It's video. Uh -huh. So the, the whole idea is to make sure that we duplicate uh, the same world standard operating room as we enjoy in the West. We will have it in Nigeria, in Anambra State. Now, the whole idea is to take the same technology, the same architecture, the same medical regulations that makes it a, a, a perfect uh, and a very, very safe environment for operation. Okay, so, so this is one of those uh, uh, surgical suites out of the 12. Oper 13 or 12 operating rooms that will have all over the valley and uh, uh, having successfully uh, dealt to this the whole idea is to go ahead and duplicate the same thing in sub-saharan africa this is 2020 there's no need for any nation to go to another nation for healthcare the healthcare should be very 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 close to every individual every individual should be able to have access to healthcare whenever it is necessary my view is to make sure having given the opportunity having been able to obtain western education in healthcare delivery that we're going to bridge the gap so that uh, people's lives are saved in a timely manner um, without looking for a way to transport them overseas. This is 2020. This is a new millennium. And because it's a new millennium, we should be able to understand and learn what other nations able to enjoy. At what point should we realize that all men are created equal? There's no difference between brain. The brain is the same. It's about how much are you exposing the brain just like the color of our blood. That's the same way the brain is created. You challenge the brain, it will learn the same thing somewhere in the south, in the north hemisphere, or south hemisphere, in the western world, and the eastern world. The same thing. There's no difference. It's a matter of how much the brain is challenged. So there's nothing like a superior brain based on skin color. Thank you very much.